Hi dear Aries, a very very good afternoon to you guys. This is Anjali Taro and this is a general reading for all the Aries, Sun, Moon, Venus rising. Keep in mind this is general. It might or might not resonate with you at the first place. The second thing, the roles can be reversed anytime. Third thing, this is a reading from uh, 11 till the 21st of July. So let's start. Your partner's current feelings for you right now are, let's see. Death and rebirth. I feel this person is feeling like this is a 360 degree transformation of this connection. This connection is over. Something is over here. Something is done here. Something is dead. Something is just done. So I have to clarify death. Could be dealing with the Scorpio here. Let me clarify the death and rebirth for you. Nine of Swords, Nine of Cups and Ten of Okay Wands and the Judgment Card. Second chances, a rebirth. So this person feels like running to or rushing towards you because you are their wish fulfillment, wish fulfillment. And I do see this is the end of this wait. You know, they they, know, they can't wait anymore because you are their wish fulfillment and they are ready to drop the weight. Uh, drop the weight that they are feeling or drop the, uh, you know, they are feeling some kind of weight. They are feeling some kind of uh, uh, heaviness, the burden. The burden that they are that they are feeling, they want to drop it. They want to rush towards you and they want to end the weight. They can't wait any longer. So this is the end of the way that they are that they were doing from a very long time. They feel you are their wish fulfillment, you are their true happiness, and they want to just drop this heaviness. So from this burden, you know, and come towards you straight away. Wow. This is Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Let's see what you feel for this person, Aries. Your feelings for them right now. Six of Cups, wow, you're in nostalgia, you're, you're waiting for this reconciliation, you're waiting for this person. This is a past person definitely and you're waiting for this person to have a reconciliation with you. You're missing this person very badly, very badly. You're missing, you're uh, having severe nostalgia about this person, about this connection. Let me clarify the Six of Cups. Page of Swords, Two of Pentacles and the Seven of Swords and the Eight of Swords at the bottom of the deck. So you're, you're watching this person online, you're juggling. You're constantly juggling and you have something to share with this person. Might be the, some kind of secret came out and that's why you're juggling uh, between the past person and the present situation. Might be you have some secret to share with this person and that is why you're juggling whether this person is going to be with you or reject you or this relationship is ever going to be the same again so it's kind of a juggling situation it's kind uh, it's kind of a juggling situation right you're watching this person you're missing this person a lot but there's something that is secretive here something some kind of secret is yet to be revealed or the secret is revealed that is why you are kind of secret that is why you are kind of juggling you know uh, constantly juggling in your mind regarding the situation so Gemini, libra aquarius a aries Leo, sagittarius energy is not here actually uh, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius and Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Let's see what this person wants from you, Aries. Tower in reverse. Mending things. Towers is like falling off. Everything is falling apart. They want to mend things with you. This person definitely wants to mend things with you, right? And they want you to come out of this uh, conflicted state of mind, this secretive state of mind, okay? They want to mend things with you, build things with you again. Let me clarify the tower in reverse. Six of Cups and King of Wands and the Queen of Pentacles. Yes, seriously, this person wants to work on this connection with you. They want this connection back with you. This is what they want. They want this connection back with you. This want, They want this reconciliation. They want you guys to be a pair. They want both of you to be a pair. King of Wands and Queen of Pentacles. They are the one who is a risk taker and they feel like you are the one who is uh, uh, very grounded and a very mature person, very independent person. And they want to be a pair with you. They want to bring this energy of king and queen back together, having a reconciliation with you, mending things with you, healing things with you. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn and Aries, Leo, Sagittarius energy. Let's see what you want from this person, Aries. Queen of Wands, yeah. You want a brand new beginning with this person. You want to manifest this person in your life. You want to attract this person in your life. Okay. You want to be very attractive. You want to be very flirty. You want to be available. You want to be uh, very. You want to take a risk actually with this person because 
queen of wands and king of wands are risk takers they love challenges you want to uh, you want to you know live this challenge you want to grab this challenge to live with this person to start uh, again with this person you know you are manifesting this person back in your life so it's uh, aries your sagittarius energy let me clarify the queen of wands wheel of fortune the world card and seven of pentacles yeah ace of swords clarity truth you are waiting for the clarity and the truth okay you are like uh, you uh, you are living everything on the universe you are very trustworthy that you are trusting the universe that everything is going to be fine the tables will turn in your favor although this connection is over although this uh, relationship is over right now or the things between you are over so you are still waiting for the right time to take some kind of action so this is what you want you want to wait for the right time to take some kind of action towards this person regarding this person regarding this situation regarding this relationship right this is what you want actually you want to wait for the right time to make some kind of move from your side or you are you are waiting for some kind of action from this person's side you are waiting you are trusting the universe and you are manifesting this person silently taurus virgo capricorn aries leo sagittarius let's see what to expect from this person till the 21st of july aries let's see five of wands okay there will be drama there will be drama there will be fights there will be battles there will be conflicts nobody is winning the drama but there will be drama okay i can see you guys fighting with each other for what both of you want the same thing but you guys are fighting with each other i don't know why might be there are people involved or people involved from your family side or their family side or there's somebody else from their side or somebody else from your side so people are fighting with each other there's a lot of drama going on in this connection right now but things are not sorting out okay let me clarify the five of wands hermit the six of wands and the three of cups the fight is going on the battle is going on because somebody is walking away here somebody is trying to walk away and somebody stop is trying to stop the other person so there will be silence there will be a lot of thinking about the reconciliation you know uh i feel uh, there will be a lot of thinking about the marriage part also about the reconciliation also but there will be if there is no drama you know if there is no physical drama if there is no physical fights going on i do see internal conflicts between you guys lots of cold war cold war going on between you guys cold fight cold wars and detachment and you know internal conflicts going on between you guys because one of you wants reconciliation and a happy marriage kind of relationship and the other uh, other just wants to be silent right now other doesn't want to take any kind of action so yes uh, there will be drama there will be fights there will be internal conflict and no action being taken as of now so you could be dealing with aries leo sagittarius virgo and cancer pisces scorpio okay so this is all what i have for you guys aries and i hope this helps thank you so much for connecting i'll see you soon in the next video bye bye take care god bless you namaste bye